Hi. So I'm out here at First Energy Stadium speaking with Tyler Cloyd. Tyler, uh, tremendous start here to the 2012 season. 4-0 record, 1.80 ERA, you know, proving yourself to be the real deal. Um, you know, just talk about your great success thus far. Um, it's been wonderful. Um, you know, um, uh, all my pitchers have been working and uh, we've been working down in the zone, um, you know, with the catchers. Um, Vi and LaRue and, and Kratz up in uh, Lehigh when I had the opening day start. Um, you know, we've really just been aggressive in the zone and, uh, and you know, making hitters um, uncomfortable. And uh, it's helped us out, you know, when we had to, when we've had to go out of the zone and, and, and they chase. And, um, you know, we've had great plays behind us and, and uh, you know, offensively, uh, you know, we've been um, putting up runs every game. So it's, uh, you know, it's, all, it's a whole team effort. So it's, it's pretty nice to, you know, be able to go out there and know you have the defense behind you and the run support, and uh, all you got to do is concentrate on the hitter. So, absolutely. Good. And now, you know, talk to Coach Dusty about you, and he's got you know the greatest of confidence in you. And he has great things to say about you, and clearly, you know, uh, you've got you've got command. You've got uh, a little bit of a, of a dominant uh, thing going on here in the early going. I uh, just wanted to ask you about where you, where you think you've made the most progress over the past year or two. Um, you know, definitely my mechanics. Um, you know, last year, um, you know, I started wearing down a little bit at the end of the season. Um, you know, I started realizing, you know, that I was, uh, you know, using a, a lot of my arm to throw all my pitches and, and instead of really getting behind my body and, and uh, taking a lot of the strain off my arm. So, you know, this offseason we really uh, uh, concentrated on, um, I concentrated on working on using more of my body, um, using the mound to, for what it's for and, and uh, doing that. And that's helped me uh, be down in the zone a lot more, um, be more consistent with more of my pitches. And, uh, you know, it, you know, being down in the zone, it's going to help you out a lot, you know, and not leaving balls over the plate. So, um, you know, that's all we really concentrated on. And uh, that's been working for me so far. A couple last things for you. I really appreciate the time here. Uh, you know, you, you've climbed the ladder along with your manager, Dusty Wathen, at, at at least, I think, four levels now. Um, just, just talk about Dusty and, you know, how you, how you feel that he's influenced your career. Uh, he's great. Um, you know, obviously, I've had him from the get-go. You know, right when I got drafted, uh, I was with him at Williamsport. And obviously, like I said, we've climbed the ladder uh, together. Um, and it's awesome, you know, when you have a manager um, that climbs with you like that, um, you, you know, you know him. Uh, you get to know him pretty well, um, what he likes, what he doesn't like, and how he coaches the game. And, uh, you know, he's been a great help for me. Um, you know, he's helped me, uh, you know, not only in the baseball aspect of life, but, you know, beyond uh, in, in many ways. Um, you know, so it's, it's nice to know that you have a manager in there that you, you know you can trust and, and you can talk to him about anything, you know. but. Um, I mean, I've been blessed to be in the Phillies organization. Haven't had a bad manager yet, you know. And, you know, every manager that I've been with, I've, you know, I felt that I could go in and talk with them, and they've helped me out in in many ways too. So, all right. I want to also ask um, if there were uh, specific players you looked up to growing up as a fan. Um, you know, growing up, I was always I don't know how uh, growing up in Nebraska, but I was a huge. Uh, a guy of watching the Braves and, and you know watching the Tom Glavins and the Greg Maddox, and John Smoltz, and you know just watching those guys, um, it was just unreal of how they did it um, for so long, you know. And watching Smoltz, you know, being a guy um, later in his career, you know, kind of like me, and you know, I'm not an overpowering pitcher, um, you know, I rely more on movement and and location, um, you know. So watching him and watching how he does it and stuff like that, and then. Coming into the Phillies organization, you know, and we had Jamie Moyer. Um, you know, he's the same type of guy, you know, doesn't throw really hard, but works on his location, you know, and that's kind of how I, um, you know, how I take my pitching. You know, I, I take my bullpens like that, I take the game like that. I'm not a guy that's going to throw, you know, high velocity and throw by guys. You know, I'm a location guy, so it's, it's kind of nice to be able to watch those guys and, and, and really see how they did it.